good afternoon and welcome to another edition of our online class and today we're talking about a very, very sensitive and essential part of an energizer why did i say energizer and why did i say sensitive the classified information so if you're an installer out there you are a final user i want you to pay attention to this classified information i can tag it as a uh, classified information 101 like i promise i'm going to be giving you information you need tech information that will help you these are things you spend money on you see knowledge is power i am empowering you don't expect i'm going to do my my stay my channel decide one they want to do give you i've been giving give away but one thing is i pass knowledge and which I believe is power. All you need in the present world today is knowledge, and with knowledge, you can achieve anything. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe, share it, tag other persons, even click on the notification button. Just share with friends, it costs you nothing because it's an information that everyone needs. Due to the popular demand, somebody called me. Uh, I think um, barely a month ago, he asked a question. He said, "This energizer, what happened? I just fixed the, the the power. It was burnt. I changed the power, and after recoiling it, I fixed it back. The alarm uh, lamp started coming on. So the thing started. The alarm always go off. He made it put on the energizer. The alarm go off automatically, and it was not like that before. Again, I think." Uh, just last week again another person said this he said at this i just record my energizer after fixing after recoiling i tried putting on this energizer the alarm is just going off and i told him what i would do i think i'll just try to address this so for all installers out there take note now from the video we're going to be doing today i want to show you how you fix energizer with that kind of alarm before you know, maybe you just happen to, okay, maybe there's a surge in the house and your, your transformer is burnt. And you take it to your technician and they just say, okay, fine, we'll help you recoil it, they recoil and they couple the whole thing. Before you know, you start having the alarm light coming on. Let me tell you what you do. From the video, you see this picture you're seeing right now, this is the bottom part of your of your energizer the bottom part you know you have the the part the the panel at the top let me show you we can say this is a panel this is how the panel looks like the top part of the panel is either like this or you have it this way like this so from this from this energizer you notice at the bottom of this energizer there's this led at this very position this position the part that is circled the part you see circled here there's you see that that led led there's one it's kind of a light you see as if it's a light and from the other part i showed you before the other part of the energizer that all okay this one if you see here there's this other led here on this other one most times, maybe your technician, your technician, finish. Uh, what do I say? Finish um, rewinding the coil of the power transformer for that which one, the one that charges it. You notice they try to cover something happens during that process. You see this LED, and for the one at the bottom, most times they mistakenly use the cover to push that LED down as away from because there's a particular hole where this LED is supposed to come out from and if, and if it's not in that very channel it's not coming out from that channel you notice one thing that imagine you put the top cover you notice your alarm start your, your energizer start raising alarm it start raising that alarm because they are supposed to have direct contact with each other the top LED and the bottom LED must meet inside that channel where the bottom one must enter 
But most technicians, I mean, they put the bottom one, they put that cover, the top one, because the hole is very small, you don't notice it. You just put your cover and it presses that LED down. You don't even take note of it. And you feel, maybe you put the other part, you cover it, you see it's charging, but the alarm starts going off. It is because that LED has not been aligned. So take note, this LED must be aligned always. Imagine it's aligned with the, with the top one and the bottom one, meet at that very hole. There's a hole, this, that hole at the bottom of the, from the bottom where you place the top cover. They must meet at that hole. Imagine they meet, they have that, that uh, meet at that very point. There's this uh, connection between the top LED and the bottom LED. Then you notice that issue is sorted out. So this is stuff that people pay heavily. And I'll be sincere with you. This is stuff I'll tell you right from time. I charge heavily for it. I charge heavily. Most times I charge them 15,000 for me to get this sorted. But you are getting all this for free. So you should take note of this. So I think this is all I want to give us for today. What I want us to know because it has become a popular demand. And I feel you need to know, you need to, you need to know about it. Yes. So thank you for watching this very edition of this class. I know you enjoyed this very class. I know you enjoyed it and you are so much, I would say you are super excited. If you like this video, please click on the like button, share this video, share with friends. You can also, do I say, subscribe to this channel and also encourage others to subscribe because back to back, I've been giving you information uh, should I say things that you would have spent heavily on you'll be getting them for free and when you this one will make you a better installer at the end of the day please I, I, don't forget our training is for 15th of uh, August 2023 for those who are interested in the smart switches you can also we still have a couple of uh, numbers left you can also identify call us just let me know you can even drop a drop a message on a, 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 on this on this page so we can also reach you till we meet again in our next class do have a nice day thanks for watching